Question number four. Order. Sarah Dowie. I thank you, Mr Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Justice. What recent announcements has she made about justice sector investment? Mr. The Speaker. Honourable Amy Adams. Mr. Speaker, today I announced that the justice sector has allocated $257 million of savings since 2012 into justice sector initiatives. The justice sector fund enables underspends across all justice sector agencies to be retained and reused to fund projects that support the reduction of crime and allows agencies to trial new initiatives that deliver better results for New Zealanders. Since 2012, 60 initiatives across the five justice sector agencies have been funded. Once the initiatives have shown that they're effective, they're then able to seek long-term funding through the annual budget process. Oh, very good. Supplementary. Supplementary question, Sarah Dowie. Uh, to the Minister, what are some of the key initiatives that have been funded by the Justice Sector Fund? Mr. Speaker. The Honourable Amy Adams. Well, the initiatives funded uh, by the Justice Sector Fund since 2012 include a suite of family violence initiatives totalling $15.4 million, including over $2 million for the rollout of the ISR pilots in Christchurch and Waikato, $8.4 million into restorative justice programmes to reduce reoffending, $14.2 million into mental health services across the justice sector, and an additional $1.2 million for the alcohol and drug treatment courts, $2.3 million for community and iwi panels that respond to low-level offending and address factors related to offending, and the Department of Corrections out-of-gate program to support the reintegration of prisoners on their release. These initiatives, alongside many others, and the work that the five justice sector agencies do, make significant differences in how we protect New Zealanders. Great. Good. Good. Question number five, Jacinda Ardern. Thank you.